am in the new season of Ashram because I think uh, that's what I've been telling everyone and especially Prakash sir that I manifested it. Last year during the lockdown, the moment I went back to Delhi, I saw Ashram with my parents, my family, my sister. And I was like, wow, it's such a great show to be a part of, you know, it's been number one of India. And next thing I know this year, Prakash sir calls me that there's this character called Sonia. Isha, I know that you will suit this role and I only see you as Sonia. This character of a woman who is a kingmaker, I think the thoughts and the characterization and the, and the story which Prakash Ji has brought into it is a lot to do with what happens in the world around us. A lot of these big people use these kind of people to help them get name and fame, you know, even though they're not good people. She was more suited for this sort of character. She comes in as an image builder. She's smart and she has her own kind of goals and ambitions and greed to fulfill and she does that. The first day to made a shoot was it was a big huge scene. I have to dance and do all of the drama. In series, me jaate toh gaane hote nahi hai. And jo Prakash sir ne mujhe bataya tha ki ham gaana shoot kar rahe tumhare and Bobby ke saath. Unhone mujhe gaana tab rough tha jo sunaya. But jab maine suna and unhone choreography dikhai, bahut hi sundar, bahut hi sensual choreography hai. Wo hamari dono ki chemistry dikhani ki koshish kiya jo Sonia and Baba ji ke beech mein. Sonia kya kar rahi hai, kyu kar rahi hai? Wo gaane mein ek reason hai. Baba ka man sab pe lag jata hai. Soni, Soni, Sonia dikhi nahi aaj court mein. Mil ke jaati to aashirwad de deta. Vimal presents Ek Badnaam Ashram Bhag 3.